Hello everybody, my name is Leo Weiss and I'm here with Viking Fun today. He's my brother on the camera. Yep, I am. Okay, so, first things first, I'm not very good with this camera thing, so have some patience with me and uh, let's go with it. Uh, what we're going to be doing today is polishing some rocks. What do you think, Viking Fun? Yeah, sounds like a good idea. Awesome. We have some that we've already started. We did the coarse grit. We brought down a lot of the hard edges. Got excited. Thought I found gold. Turns out it was just a big chunk of pyrite. Yeah, you can see the nice shininess. Now, we discussed doing the second batch and doing the fine grit on these ones, but I think we're going to move to a different type of rock and we're going to be doing some this more of the agate to make some nice shiny ones. So some of the samples that we have are we have some rough agate, we have some calcite with some quartz and some agate. Yeah. Got some other big chunks of rock that we're going to go smash with a hammer. Yeah. Maybe I'll get lucky and get to hold the camera. Yeah. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> this is one of my favorites. Oh, yeah. Look at that. If somebody's got a way to polish that whole thing. That'd be awesome. Tell me how to polish that. I don't I we yeah. don't know yet. We haven't really looked it up on the old interweb. Yeah. So we know we could be inventing something brand new. I wouldn't go that far, man. These are millions of years old. Yeah, I know. <laughs> cool, so our uh, agate. Yep, that's definitely a nice piece of sample of agate. And we got these uh just outside of Princeton uh British Columbia. Yeah, oh. like like a month or two ago. Yeah. The weather's getting cold. Now it's time to have some fun. Exactly. Well, we'll check in with you guys later on the next stage. This is the rock we're going to bust open. We're going to bust it open. Not the ideal hammer, but... Uh, yeah, the bigger one would smash into a million pieces. Well, I, I don't really want that. I'd rather have a rock hammer or something. Oh, there we go. Look at this little sample, guys. I think this is calcite or something. Yeah, definitely something like that. Doesn't look like quartz. Yeah, it really doesn't. Interesting. Delicately smash this rock open. Yep. Very delicately. <laughs> okay, this is a much nicer looking piece right there. Oh, yeah. It's like that is that is stunning. It's like calcite and agate. Yeah. A little bit big for the. Oh. Hey. We got prizes. We got prizes, guys. Oh, I don't want to put it up there. Look at these goodies. They're gonna look so nice. They're gonna look so magnifique. Okay, now this is gonna be a couple chunks of agate. Oh yeah. A little bit of hot glue. I had it apart as another craft. Oh. Of course you did. Oh, it was on the marble run. Had, yeah. to, had to have an obstacle. Yeah, okay. The sample. That's big. Definitely nice. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a little too big. Just one more like smack, and it should be decent. It's gonna break into a thousand pieces. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. 
got got greedy. Everyone's sort of wondering what that little wording is on your hand. Oh, uh, it was the date and the time. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, crumb cakes. Told That's you. not good. Told you it would break into more pieces than a lot of it. No, at, least, but at least we have this. This is all that matters. This piece is revolutionary. You guys in, my, in, in my opinion. You guys will break pretty easy. Yeah. They're gonna look so cool. And this video is a taste of what future rock videos will look like when I create my rock, when my rock channel starts getting videos. This video is going on to my main channel. So I just want them, you guys to know if you like this kind of stuff. Because if you do, then I will have a rock jam channel ready to go for you in no time. And you'll see this guy quite often. You guys. Yeah. Nah. Last. Pretty nice sample. Last one. I think we got way more than we'll need, but. Definitely. I'm gonna have to find that and get that rock polish that you have out. Anybody else have a rock polish that they're sitting around in their closet they want to get rid of or yeah. lend us? That'd be awesome. Yeah, we'll, we'll appreciate everything. You guys. Very nice. Okay. Well, we'll check back in in a bit. Yep. Legal Bice with Biking Fun again. I guess I don't need to announce myself every single time. That's one of those things you can cut out, Heath. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. we got our rock chunks. Yes, we have our rock chunks. So, we can put them in there. I know we're going to lose a, a lot of good crystal and a lot yeah, of good stuff, but... That's life, that's life, that's how we do it. But we always find more, because that stuff's easy to find. Just have to look for decent rocks to bash open. But we're, but we're still on the prowl for geodes. Yeah, we were able to cut four geodes this year. So yeah. we put rocks in all around the same size, the same hardness. Uh, yeah. And one geode was one of the rarest geodes found because it's not very na natural. Well, this is all natural. It's probably organic, too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> organic. But it's definitely an unbelievable occurrence. The smoky quartz, I don't know what, what Black it is. smoky so. quartz geode. Yeah, so we're going to take our fine, our coarse grit. Yeah. Got to take that gritty stuff and add it into the mix. And then some water gets added to it, guys, and then get this. No, I don't add any water to it anymore. Yeah. Oh. I've been educated on that one. And then it actually creates this paste. That gets stuck on the side of the rock, and then it all gets stuck on the inside of the tumbler. Oh. And then what ends up happening is is that it becomes like this concrete that rolls around in there, and then the stones actually don't erode or break down and get rid of the sharp edges as quickly. Okay, now I know. I now know to tell my dad that when we do some more tumbling in the future. Well, different tumblers and different techniques. And this is just one that I've found. Of course, yeah, after pretty... after the final stage of the ones me and my dad did, we had to get like that, like oil to add to the rocks to shine them up a bit. They're, they're, they're not the best looking shiny rocks. They're meh. We'll see how it goes. We have uh, close to a month and a half. We're gonna be doing the uh, coarse grit for two and a half weeks. We'll do the medium grit for two and a half weeks. Then we'll do the pre-polish. Yep. Pre-polish. So polish. So I, I believe that's for a week. And then we'll do the polish for a week as well. Um, obviously, I'm going to be looking this up a little bit more, so I'm not wasting materials. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. All I have to do now is put this guy on. Just plug it in. 
Trust me, guys, this makes quite a bit of noise. When it's sitting on the carpet, it doesn't. But I have to say, the one I have at home is actually louder than this. Is it? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm looking forward to having that one in my living room, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh. All right. Yeah, so start small. Start polishing a few rocks here and there. Have a little bit of fun. Uh, I know I'm saying this on a computer, but I mean, uh, detach from the computer, get grounded, find some rocks, have some fun. Yeah. Peace out, guys. Yep. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like, subscribe, a comment down below, and let me know what you want me to do in the future. Goodbye, everyone.